Florida Governor Ron DeSantis has been consistently polling right behind Trump, even though he hasn't announced his presidential run yet, if he is going to announce. Has this indictment helped him at all in the polls, hurt him at all? How is that impacting DeSantis? So the indictment does not appear to have had much effect on Trump standing among voters Um, in the CNN SSRS poll that I've been mentioning. His approval rating actually climbed two points since the group's previous poll taken in January. He's up to 34 percent. And in a PBS Marist poll that was taken after news broke that Trump was expected to be indicted, but before the Manhattan grand jury actually voted to indict him, an important distinction. Um, Trump was polling at 50 percent. 50 percent of Republican leaning voters said that they plan to cast their ballots for Trump in next year's primary compared to 24 percent who said that they expected to vote for DeSantis. And that's um, that that 24 percent is consistent with DeSantis's standing in previous polls. But Trump had actually gained four points since uh, the group's previous poll, which I believe was taken in February. So I think that that is less about the indictment and more about the fact that Trump has been able to weather some of the um, storms and controversies that he saw shortly after announcing his third run for the White House in November. You know, he was widely blamed for the party's worse than expected midterm performance among uh, many of his preferred candidates who lost uh, key Senate races. He had a controversial dinner, as we know, with white supremacist Nick Fuentes and Kanye West at Mar-a-Lago. He suggested parts of the Constitution should be thrown out and he be reinstated president. And so I think that, um, you know, and at the time, many prominent GOP lawmakers came out and criticized him publicly in, in all of those instances. And in the wake of this indictment news, you know, they have been forced to rally behind him. So I think that a lot of Americans have sort of forgotten about those controversy controversies. And, um, you know, DeSantis and Trump have both been ramping up their campaigns as well in the, the past several months. So a lot is changing very quickly in this primary race.